don't be sad. Hmm? Let's read. Wow. Read for fun. Hi, kids. Welcome back to Read for Fun. I am Miss Soraya, and I'm the voice behind the books. Before we begin, I want to give a shout out to my younger sister, Teacher Nikki, who is also a special ed teacher just like me. Hi, Nikki, and hi to Teacher Nikki's class. Thank you so much for watching our read alouds and reading along with me. If you want to be featured in any of the read alouds, head on over to my Instagram account and send me a message. I will make sure to give you a shout out on our next read aloud. For today's read aloud, we are going to read Don't Eat Bees. Life Lessons from Chip the Dog, written by Deb Petty, illustrated by Mike Bolt. Make sure to pay attention to the story and read along with me because I have some comprehension questions for you at the end of this read aloud. Okay, let's begin. I am a smart dog. I am only seven, but that is practically 50 in person years. So I already know several important dog things. Like how cats are awfully self-important for animals who poop in a box. I know you can dig one big hole and put 30 bones in it. Or dig 30 holes and put a bone in each. Another thing I know, somehow, these are all dogs. Yes, all of them, even that one. But most of my vast knowledge involves what to eat and what not to eat. I will share what I know. Do eat socks. That is why they come in pairs. There's a spare one just for you. Don't eat bees. Do eat important papers. Like the ones the small persons work on when they finally come home after forever. Pro tip, if you eat them, your small persons will have to stay home to make new important papers. But don't eat bees. Do eat the giant bird they cook at Thanksgiving. Grab what you can and run. It's a fun game, and you deserve a little fun. Remember all those papers you ate? Bees? No. Do eat Grandpa's teeth. It will make Grandpa smile, and that, my friend, will make everyone smile. But don't eat bees. Do eat the cat food just because you can. Who's a dumb dog now, Mittens? Not me. I don't eat bees. Do eat the foods your small person doesn't like to eat. This will make them love you. And they will scratch that special itchy spot you can't reach. Yes, bees. No, bees. Eat the car. Eat plants. Eat dirt. Comes with plants. Eat shoes. Eat the couch. It had it coming. Eat the mail. For sure, eat the sandwich. It was obviously for you, since it had all your favorite stuff in it. Don't eat lemons or fire or bees. See, I know a lot of things, 
I am so smart that I can tell you I would never, ever do something as silly as eating a bee. No, sir. Never, ever, ever again. <laughs> but cactuses? Mittens has been telling me good things about cactuses. I am a smart dog. Now time for some comprehension questions. Question number one. Who is the main character in the story? A. Chip the dog. B. Finn the frog. Or C. Squirrel. The correct answer is A. Chip the dog. Question number two. How old is Chip? A. 4, B, 55, or C, 7? The correct answer is 7. Question number 3. What does Chip know a lot about? A, cats, B, bees, or C, what to eat and not to eat? The correct answer is C, what to eat and not to eat. Question number four, true or false? Chip said to eat grandpa's teeth, but don't eat bees. True or false? The correct answer is true. I hope that you answered all of the questions. Thank you for reading along with me. I'll see you on my next read aloud. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like this video or read aloud and subscribe to this channel. See you next time. Bye.